Hello everyone, so you're making again with the epic chemist. So hope you had a nice holiday and a Christmas vacation on the last year and a happy happy new year for y'all with luck and safeness. And okay, if your holiday was really good, just comment down below. How about the Christmas events? What happened? Okay. So, today we're gonna do periodic table, part 1 and part 2 of atoms, and part 2 of periodic table, or valency, or electronic configuration, or on our next video. So, I guess my mic quality is really good than before. Happily. Okay, so, as I said, how was your holiday? Yes, it's good. So last let's last let's move into a lesson. Today's sponsor of this video is uh, Lingoda. So you can find British English, any language you want. So I have linked down all the channels, even which entertained and give me some kind of confidence and some kind of factor or informative. I really thank Nile Red, Nile Blue, and Nile Red Shorts, the same person, and Family Balls, okay? So, I love that channel so much. So, Happy New Year for them too, uh, if they are watching. Uh, uh, and my name is Rion Milroy, and now let's move into our lesson, Periodic Table. Okay, what's an periodic table? Now, the first question much, much many people could hear or appear in their mind is what's an periodic table? Now, in one of my past videos, which I have up there, you can see it up there, on my notification. So, I did about elements, atoms and stuff. So, in the part 2 of atoms, I'm going to do compounds, how to name compounds, and under that only valency, electronic configuration comes. So I didn't do the part 2 because you need to know the periodic table before going to compounds. Okay, now many people have studied up to calcium, so I can say so fast, many of my friends. So, now, how was your day? So, I had the best holiday. Now, I'm not gonna ask right now again, but this is periodic table. Now, what's a periodic table? It's a simply collection of friends. Am I correct? No, it's wrong. It's not friends, but it's animals. But they do even have groups of friends too. Okay? So, this periodic lesson is good for uh, beginners, I guess so. And the next video is gonna be an intermediate level. So, which is gonna be bonus level. So, okay. Now, we, it's relatively beautiful. You have the atom, atomic number, mass, or the weight, or electrons per shell, something like that. So, electrons per shell, do not mix up now. I'm going to explain it later on. So, let's go to the next slide. So, these are the basic two elements. Now, we're there in the first period, period one, hydrogen and helium. So, hydrogen has many properties with others. So, it is considered as out of the uh, one, but sometimes in your table, you'll see it combined. Okay, next we have a small grid with, they have alkali metals, alkaline and stuff. I'll read more if you want to. Okay, so you have... You have alkali metals, alkaline earth metals, transition metals, 
left feet, active, post transgerminals, metalloids, reactive non metals, no gas. So hydrogen comes under reactive non gas, non metals. Reactive, non metal. So hydrogen, carbon, nitrogen, fluorine, phosphorus, sulfur chlorine, and centenium, bromine, and iodine are reactive non metals. And non metals, most of them are gases, something like car, uh, nitrogen, oxygen, fluorine, chlorine, and then reactive. Okay, now I'm going to talk about reactive stuff and non reactive and why they are non reactive and why they are reactive. How they share, how how they borrow someone's uh, electrons. So I'm going to talk about it in the bonus level or the intermediate level. Okay, so these are the two elements. Now, today in this lesson, we're going to spell out four elements okay so it's easy for you all today is spelling stuff like h hydrogen h e helium okay now you can tell with me h hydrogen okay hope you did it h e helium okay l i lithium did you do it okay I'm going to give you some time, about 30 seconds, to study. So, here the time goes. Okay, hope you have studied. Now, it's your time. Let's see. Five, four, three, two, and one. It's your time. Say it aloud. Did you do it? Oh my god. If you have done it, just comment down below. So, did you go? Oh, great, I hope. Okay, so it's a lesson and end for today. And next video is going to be about intermediate level. And hope you learned something. And goodbye. Stay safe. I need to thank the sponsor of today's video. It's named Goda. So you can find business English, English and stuff. And you can watch all the, um, all the science and entertainment uh, uh, channels. And subscribe them. And I need to thank my red and uh, uh, family boons for giving me a lot of confidence and entertainment if you want to see entertainment go to family boons see ya bye bye